Hey there, Juggies, it's Drill Palman Juggernauts here, and I am back at Uncle Larry's house after my wonderful day of work. Jesus, Christmas, I never thought I'd say that. As you can see, uh, Tom's laptop's open. Look at that nice Luigi punching a bullet bill screensaver. Wow, that says a lot about Tom. Also, I noticed we have here uh, some scraps of Corona boxes. This looks like a good uh, dozen boxes here. Um, hmm, what are we dealing with? Maybe, uh... Chronic alcoholism? I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> I, as you can tell, I'm in a great mood right now. I'm super hype. If you guys haven't seen the video, check it out. An unexpected surprise. That's in the corner. Um, I went to work today with my uncle, and my mom was there, and they were totally playing me out, making me do all these laborious tasks, leading up to a big shirt reveal. They've been working on shirts for weeks. So I got juggy t-shirts, keep rigid shirts, and guess what? In just the last three hours, I've been working on my social media game, pumping them out. We are already sold out of shirts. Unbelievable. And people were complaining, don't worry guys, we are going to go international very soon. We also just ordered 1,000 new shirts. So that means we are going to be, we're going to be swimming. So we'll have Keep It Rigid, we'll have Juggy shirts, and we'll have... Yes, can you, you just, <laughs> You totally just ruined the shot. Sorry. Can you come out and listen? What? There's, I want you to listen to something. Is everything all right? Well, you tell me. Should I keep the camera on for this, or? Well, that's up to you. You like to do that stuff, but. All right. You're freaking me out. Well. Don't kill the vibe. We had a good day today with shirts. We sold. We sold out. Come on. Yeah, come well, on. that's good, but. What? This is what I came home to. What is you it? have one old What is this? Message. Tuesday, 2.30, 6 p.m. Hey, Larry, Jeff. Um, heard through the grapevine. Are you kidding me? Uh, nope. Jesse might be uh, hanging out or living there with you. Um, yeah, I'm just uh, having a little problem with that. Uh, if he is, because, hey, we're trying to do a, you know, help him out there, get a job, get a life, you know. He's got to do mm. stuff on his own. You know, we can't, you know, just can't be coddling and things. You know, we got to. We gotta do something for the boy, you know, he's just skating around doing nothing. What a joke. Playing video games, so things boring. like that. Look, yeah, yeah. Let me call him again. 22 freaking years. Because I want to get this uh, just in the butt. Because if he's there, I really don't want him to be living there. Because, uh, you know, it didn't right. It's going against what we're trying to do. Give me a call. Bye. And did you call him? Yeah, I called and, him. Uh, Maybe we you should... didn't tell him I was here, did you? I, I don't lie to people, so. You told him I was here? I told him that you were here. I mean, he already knew you were here. What the? What did he say? But he already knew that you were here. And How the? What did Jeffrey tell him? Well, that you tell me. You're the one with the camera all the time. I don't know. Does Jeffrey watch the? Videos? Yeah, he he has. But I don't I don't know why he would. Maybe my mom said something. Like I went to work today with you guys. Maybe one of. I don't think she. I don't think. I don't think she would say anything. Shit. I really don't think she would say. Anything. I mean, what did he say on the phone? He's pissed. Fuck. He's pissed and, he, and you know, let's sit down and talk about this. Yeah, well, all right. Well, fucking Garfunkel Maybe over here. Maybe now you should have a beer. <laughs> you almost got me, but... I... No, so what, are you kicking me out then? No, I don't want to I don't want to kick you out, but... You know, here, here I'm between a rock and a hard place. What do I do? Yeah, I understand. I mean, like I told you before, I've been, I didn't want to get involved with this. Yeah. I really didn't. But... You know, I love you. I love my sister. You know, and I, I've been friends with you. We have, we got a good time. thing going with these T-shirts. I mean, this is gonna mess it all up if he gets involved. Well, when I was talking to him on the phone, I don't understand his whole problem with this. But, I, I don't. But it's like he doesn't want you in the house. He thinks like like here he, he doesn't want in this house. In this house. And I don't understand why. I mean, what? How's that affecting him? At all. I don't, he wants to make my life a living hell. He thinks it's teaching me something, but it's not. It's doing the exact opposite. Right. He's very irrational. Thank you. But what do I do? What I, do I do? I mean... I don't know. I I could go back to Zach's house, but I, I don't really want to do that. I like it here. I'm getting comfortable. And, and I want to stay close to where this shirt thing is so we can manage that together. Yeah, I know. I just... Yeah, I'm gonna if if he you're continuously in the house, I'm gonna hear yeah. a bunch of shit. Now when I talk to him, you know, I said it's just your problem is just inside my house, right? Because you know I told him, you know, 
I can't stop you from being outside. If you yeah. wanted to go in a tent outside, I have no problem with it whatsoever, Jess. A tent? What's the wall? What, 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 can't we go back and get into the RV? Again, I told you with the RV, you it's yours after the 26th. You can't like rush that and then... He's down for a work job. He can't... My friend can't just tell his people at work he has no place to stay. I mean, he's rent. He, you know, he's paying me for that. Yeah. And I can't, I can't do that. Now, this kid I've been friends with longer than your dad, so it's like... Right. Right. I say kid. This man. Yeah. But after the 26th, it's fine. You lived in a tent for how long? It was like a week and a half to two weeks. Yeah. And, and I, I mean, it wasn't bad. I mean, I actually kind of enjoyed it, but it's just like I'm getting really comfortable in here. Well. Is that? That's your dad. Are you fucking kidding me? What the hell does it say? Was it a text message? Yeah, it just has to do with work. He put some kind of cover in my truck for, for work. Oh, jeez. I mean, I could, I, could, I could stay in a tent if you think that makes sense. Well, it's like, here, why don't we do this? And this way, it kind of takes me off the hook a little bit. All right. Um, you, when I'm not home, yeah. if, if you came in the house, I just don't want to know about it. Tom can, Tom's home. He can let you in. You can do whatever you want. Just when I'm home. So this way, if your dad asks me, I'll be like, he's not staying in the house. I think... What I if think, he comes here? Just don't answer the door. He won't come here. He works. He works every day. Until you get set up to the point where you're actually got some cash coming in. Right. And you can pay for board. I think that's when it's going to show your dad that... Yeah. That you have some kind of responsibility. I think that's what it's going to take. <sighs> you don't have to worry about food. You know, we'll take care of all, all that stuff for you. Beer, yeah, that's covered apparently. Well, yeah, you can have beer. <laughs> we got plenty of that. Carfunkel, what do you think about this business? That's about the response you're going to get from her for everything. I don't know. I I could live in a tent. I, if that's what it takes. It's totally up to you. And it will just, just till the 26th. Yeah, I mean, you could stay at Zach's till the 26th. I thought about that, and sadly, I, I'd rather live in the tent. Zach was ever, never home, and I don't know, it was, it was weird to be there. I liked the tent, because, you know, it was my own thing. And I, I felt like, I felt independent. That's what I'm saying, it's four days. You did two weeks, you can do four days in it. Okay. And like I said, you got the RV after that. All right. That's what we're going to do then. And in the meantime, it's like I said, for showering, you know, or if you needed to come in to get something to eat or something like that, just Tom will let you in. And I just don't want to know about it. I'm going to tell Tom not to tell me about it. Okay. That way, if your dad says, you know, has Jesse been living in your house? I'm like, no, he's not. All right. Let's do that. All right. This tent is nice size, right? I actually got two of them. I got a, a pretty decent sized one and a smaller one. You got two? Yeah. I didn't have two. We're back at Eagle's Landing. <laughs> it's cold out. Oh, wait. Oh, let me get some shoes on. Yeah, good. Oh, it's a little cold out. Yeah, it's freezing out. Do you have any more lights? Because I can't see shit on this camera. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, that works. You got it? That, yeah, that helps a bit. All right, so where are these tents at? And they are in the in the RV? No, they're in that shed right there. Okay. And you see, you have two. Well, we only we can just set one up set one tonight. Up now? Yeah. How about the smaller one? Because that would be the easiest one to set up. Whatever is easiest. And and do you have like a sleeping bag or something? Oh yeah. Oh, okay. Now there's no black widows in here, right? I'm glad. There's no. Oh, I'm sure there is. I killed like 50 of them last uh, year. Okay. <laughs> They're not deadly. Don't worry about it. Oh, wow, that's a lot smaller than what I had. Yeah, well, there's that other one right there. That's a bigger one. Okay. We can worry about I, that. That might even be a seven man. Seven? I think it might be. Yeah, I think I had a six. 
to see. Did you? Yeah. This is a three to four. All right. So you'll be cozy. All right. So, um, where do you think we should put this? All right. Well, we got to think about this, right? <sighs> well, we can't put it out here. The road's right there. Yeah. So we got to go over here. Before, right? Well, back at my house, I put it in the woods. Do you want to be in the woods? If, if we can, well, if we can avoid it, I, I don't know what you have. Why don't you be close to the house? That way, you don't. You know what I mean? Like, don't be in the in the trees and everything. Okay. Because there's no reason to be. Is there? A, have to be a little hidden. The pool might block it a bit. We, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. There's a spot of, you know, you could be anywhere from, the, the boat will cover you up. Right. Yeah. Watch out for those canoes. Okay. Um. You can go here, you can go back over here. This is a nice spot right back here. It's kind of flat. Yeah, I wish people could see on the camera. There's like nothing. No? Well, you know what? I could turn these, uh, the basketball lights on. Yeah. That way we can see actually the play Yeah, I forgot you had lights out here. Do you actually play basketball at, at night? You better believe it. <laughs> oh, shit. This bitch gets lit up like a playground. <laughs> Uncle Larry's a baller. <laughs> All right. All right, let me turn these on. So yeah, I can still, I can still see the house from here, but I can't see the road, so this might work. Hey, you don't think he saw my car, do you, on the side? That's a good point. I don't think so. But you know how hard it is to see down there? you ever drive past and try to look? No, I, I just don't. I mean, I didn't even know that road existed. I don't see how he could see that. Yeah. Unless he drove down there. I don't I, don't, know. I wouldn't put it past him, honestly. A lot brighter. All right, yeah, I can see around here now. Okay. I don't know if you're planning on going to bed, but if you want to start setting it up. I'll help you set it up. All right. Do you want to turn these on, or are you... No, nah, this is this should light. be fine. Yeah, it's like a a pop up tent, right? So we'll just take know. it out. I never set it up. <laughs> what? I told you I don't sleep in this damn tent. I got a trailer. Yeah. Why would I sleep in a tent? That's true. It's so funny you suggested this though. Like, did you know that? Like, I mean, obviously you knew I stayed in the tent, but did you know I actually enjoyed it? Did you? Yeah. I I don't know why. It's just. I, I feel like it makes things simpler. Uh, oh God! What the hell are those? These? Yeah. They're the poles that go through the little pockets. Oh shit! We gotta do all that. Yep. Oh, all right. All right. Labor yeah. This is the work now. You got me. All right, juggies. I'm gonna. Whoa! I look really sepia right now. Um, I'm gonna end this video for you guys. I need to set this down, and we need to set this tent up fast because I want to be out like a light tonight <laughs> we okay um i think this should be safe in the pool um dude i'm returning to my roots next time you see me i'll be living large in in the the new and improved eagles landing i love you guys to death don't forget to subscribe for more content all right i need to get are you you already almost got to set it up <laughs> let me just get uh take a little longer with this shot yeah, I'll be done. <laughs> all right i love you juggies to death and yes, keep an eye out for the uh, official giveaways for the Keep It Rigid shirts. And yeah, seriously, a thousand new shirts coming to you guys. Etsy shop in the description on my main channel. Keep it rigid, Juggies.